All right, what's up, folks? This is another great video showing an officer that does not know the laws of the land, the Constitution, or even care about the rights of the people. He is threatening arrest and demanding ID, saying because you're taking video and pictures, we're going to demand that you give up your ID so we can get a warrant for that video. And remember, folks, anything you can take pictures of of in public is full legal. No cops can demand you to give up your information. All right, let's get into the video. Video. It's my First Amendment right. It's my First Amendment right. If you know, it has everything to do with it. I don't want to hear it anymore. It's not your choice. So what I'm telling you, I've told you this before. You're not free to go, man. What crime have I committed? Stay right here. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Get your listen, hands off you're me. You're not listening to anything I'm telling because you. Because you're wrong. No, it's my First I'm Amendment right. You is, this is the same thing I've explained to you on 85. So everything that you take, photographs of the crime scene, videos, is subject to subpoena. All right, what crime have I committed? Okay, don't, sure, I'm don't not touch telling me. you you committed a crime. I'm explaining okay. you're not free to go. Okay, so you don't have the right to ID. detain me. Let no, me, actually, I do. Actually, I do. I haven't committed a crime. It's, it's, it's not a crime. It's going to be obstruction. It's my First <laughs> Amendment. No, I'm on public. I'm on public property. Let me see your ID. It's my First Amendment right. Let me see your ID. I'm not. No. Can get your supervisor here. Who's your supervisor? He's right over there. All right, get your supervisor. I'm identifying you. Okay, no, no. I want to see your supervisor. I want to talk to your supervisor. I want to talk to your supervisor. The supervisor is busy, man. Okay. Well, leave scene, me though. alone. It's my right. First Amendment right. Can, can, We're in the United States of you, America. I have can, not broken the law. I'm on public property. Okay. Let me, I'm not interfering sir, with your crime sir, scene. Can you stop talking and listen just for a couple of seconds, okay? As this officer is trying to explain, all right, when somebody's taking photographs, stuff like that, it may have to be used in court at a later time, man. That's 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 the only thing. You're not. We're not trying to get you in trouble. We're not trying to hem you up. Not upset that you're recording or taking pictures, man. All we want to do is just have you identified. That way, if this goes before a court or whatever, they know that you were out here and, and know that you may have a picture that's going to help them solve this crime, dude. That's it. Okay, you that's have. All it is. First of all, you have plenty of surveillance and everything of whatever happened. Just, second just of all, ID. second of all, if you or whatever you need ID. from um, my footage, ID. my camera, you need a subpoena or a warrant for that. Right, well, and, and that's, that's perfectly exactly fine. That's why we're not trying. Okay, to so you don't need my ID for that. Listen, yeah. You if, need if to go you, to the proper authorities, you, to the judge or, or the magistrate to go so, get a warrant. So if you walk away, how are we supposed to know who you are? Okay, to well, to I, camera or anything this is my okay. Time. Right now, you're not going to violate right. my Fourth Amendment right no. of um, uh, uh, seizing seizing my ID or my no, identification. Where I have not, not committed a crime. What's your name? Sir, uh, so I do by not, not giving us your name, you're delaying our investigation. If I have not committed a crime, I don't have to. I'm not required to identify myself right now. No, no, I'm not required to identify myself right now because I have not committed a crime. Oh my gosh. Okay. So what's your name? What's your name and badge number? Right here, Officer Maddox, CMPD 6161. Okay. I because I don't, I don't appreciate you touching me. Well, I've told you several times to I'm stop. executing my First Amendment it's right. Investigative detention it has nothing to do with that. So all I'm explaining to you is, oh, you already reiterated. I just need your information: first name, last name, date of birth, that's point it, of man. contact. That's it. I don't you need to give you any when of this that. This goes to the district attorney's office. You don't need any of this. I'm a, I'm a nearby stander. You don't need any of my footage. When you, you have everything. Photo, you have everything I have. I'm explaining it to you. Okay. When you take a okay, photograph you're, of the whole crime scene, they're gonna. You don't need to know who I am. Nobody here. I don't have anything. I wasn't here when the look, crime look, occurred. I'm not trying to take you downtown. Okay, me, the guy, the guy was in the stretcher before I got here. Okay. Already loaded up in the ambulance. Just Perfect. nothing here. Not that, okay. that I have about the crime. So, so I was not here when the crime was that's committed. That's awesome. So all I do so you don't need my footage. No. So what I We're do not is for your footage, I type man. in the narrative so the district attorneys know. You don't that need I my. I don't need to. All these people yes. here tell me, and you you try to point me out, try to single no, me out. You I'm not committed a crime. Me. That's, oh, that's that's outside outside, outside of the crime scene on public property. That's fine. I'm taking. I'm on a public sidewalk right now. All right. So we, we, we can see his face. We know we'll figure it out. I'm out of here, man. You know, I'm going to write your ass up. Please. All right. Have a great, Have a great night. night.